there's a lot more emotional stress and, and pressure that's put on the kid to just, you have to get through it. So, you know, there's so little she gets to control. Um, and, and when we think about what are the side effects that any kid goes through, people really think about the basics and, you know, it's the baldness and the nausea, but there's, there's hundreds of things. The, the hard part, and I get a little emotional about it, is, you know, there, there are costs, there are huge costs, but she's here and that's, that's what we go for. So I think that the side effect that probably scare, you know, scares you the most or what you think about is, you know, what if it doesn't work or, or how much time are we buying? And in her case, we're really lucky because we're still talking cure. There's, we're not having to, to buy time. That's not what we're doing at this point. But um, it doesn't feel lucky all the time. Even on her lowest day, what I want is for people to understand this is, this is the true part of it. And, and this is just the beginning. So it's, it's juggling the the cornucopia, I guess, of side effects and figuring out which one is the least evil and how do you how do you make sure she's a whole person at the end of it, both psychologically, physically, emotionally, and, and just really feels hopeful versus like this is just happening to me and it's always going to just happen to me. And I think that's why relapse, that side effect was really the worst, right? Because you, you felt like you served your time, you did what you were supposed to do. You know, her body went through everything and it still happened. So I think when people say they understand pediatric cancer, that we've made huge strides, you know, oh, le leukemia, that now 90% of kids are, are being cured. Well, if you were a part of the 10%, how would you feel? People a lot of times think they can't help um, because they don't have tons of money, right? But every dollar adds up. You know, I always say if everybody at one football game for Michigan gave $1, we could fund research for a year for somebody. And there are still so many parents who get the diagnosis every year and there is nothing for them to do. And so I think what I would say ultimately is it's hugely impactful in terms of the numbers of years lost for children and the impact on families and whole communities. Um, and so we just gotta keep trying harder.